What's up, what's up, what's up? Today, I cleaned my old hat. And you know what that means. I'm not a rookie. Rookies never have to clean their hat because they put it on brand new. They put it on brand new, but look, check this hat out. Let's see, we put it right under the light so everybody can see it. Look, this old hat, this old hat, I cleaned it many times. Many times. Have you ever seen somebody come on to the job site? Have you ever seen someone come on to the job site with the cleanest hat? Looking so clean. And you think, how is this guy going to get something done? He's going to be caring more about that hat than he is going to be caring about the job. With that being said, how many times have you cleaned your hat? How many times have you claimed you're a professional at something and then you come dressed to be the clean guy? Huh? Look at his hat. Look at his hat. Let's see. Can I put it underneath that? Can you see some of the... I just got through cleaning it. But you can see... It's not the cleanest hat no more. This thing, man, this thing fits my head. It's been on there for a while. How many of you can say that? That you've been working and grinding where the hat molds your head, huh? How many of you can say that? Well, watch me and uh, follow me because I'm gonna tell you what. This guy right here, I've been struggling, I've been grinding, I've been coming out of uh, a lot of debt, and uh, I'm on my way out, now I'm on my way to the top. I'm going to tell you one thing, it's harder to come from $300,000 in debt and get to zero with no credit than it is to go from zero to a million with credit. And I'm going to show you how. I'm not a financial advisor or nothing, but follow me, watch me, see what I do. See what I do, and uh, you're going to see how this hat comes in effect. This guy ain't new to nothing. This old hat, I get a new hat probably once, once a year because I get them pretty dirty. I get hats pretty dirty, and sometimes I'll keep one for three years. But then, if you want to look at something else, check this out. These old boots. Check this out. These old boots. Mm -hmm. How many people uh, come to the job site with these brand new boots and say, yeah, I know how to do everything. <laughs> Have you ever seen that guy before? Who's a uh, business owner? and uh, you uh, are hiring and people come in with brand new hats on. Hmm? Brand new hats on. <laughs> and brand new boots. Look at these old boots. Look at these old boots. Look at them babies. Even the shoestrings are going bad. But you know what? When you have something that's old, it gets comfortable, right? It gets comfortable, and it feels like you ain't even wearing them old boots. Unless they're some cheapies. <laughs> but my boots, man, I love my boots. I'm trying to find another pair just like them. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, when you're going to a job interview, scuff them boots up a little bit. Put a little dirt on that hat. Don't go to a job interview with the brand new hat and the brand new boots and say I know everything. I know everything, I know how to do everything. Okay, go do them stairs over there. Man, you go do them stairs, they'll be inches off. <laughs> no, but um, you can always learn, whether you're old or new. But remember, the guy with the old boots, man. Look at that. Look at them old boots. Look at them old boots. Look at this old hat. I just got through washing the hat up, you know. Got to take care of it a little bit. 
But these old boots, I don't care about these old boots. I don't care care about my hat. But I just made a video on Instagram. Go check it out about my hat. And I cleaned it up. So I made a video before on Instagram. I cleaned it up. This is the after. So that's how I do it. It's Dennis Repetition. Look at these old boots. That dude knows how to do stuff. A guy with boots like that, he knows how to do stuff. That's who you want. The guy with the old boots. Don't get that guy with the brand new boots. Look like he can't even bend them things. Ain't even going to be able to bend down and do nothing. Look at these old boots. Check this out. Check this out. And then check out my video where uh, I made a video on some brand new boots I bought. But go to work one day. Gets a little wet. And you know what? The whole boot falls apart. So then I caught it the... Uh, the foot monster boots and chased my kids around with them. So remember that you got to get a good boot. I can recommend these boots because I probably had them for four years. Four years. They're Timberlands. Look at that. Look at that. Them babies are good boots. These are some good boots. They've been through a lot. I do construction every day. And these boots hold up. Yeah. So, everybody, I just thought I'd make this video so that uh, you could relate. The guy that comes to the job site with the brand new hat, the brand new boots, and says he knows everything. Uh, I don't think so. <laughs> okay. Now, for my Spanish-speaking uh, audience out there. Now I'm going to do it in Spanish. So we're done with the English, everybody. Thank you and follow me. And now if you want to learn a little bit of Spanish, continue watching. Okay? Thank you, everybody. Now for Spanish. Ahora en español. Mira. Mira ese gorra. Mira ese gorra. Se ve bien. Se ve nuevo, right? Porque apenas lo lavé. Apenas lo lavé y lo lavé porque estaba poniendo cochino. Y yo lo dije, este gorro enseña las experiencias que ha pasado. Alguien que para los dueños de negocios que están buscando gente para trabajar y que vienen a buscar trabajo. Con el gorro nuevo. Este. Nuevo, nuevo. De paquete. Viene, viene a buscar un trabajo de construcción. Y viene con una gorra nuevo de paquete. Y luego, mira, mira. También vienen con unas botas. Nuevecitos. Que ni se doblan. Pinches botas. Pinches botas. Este, si tratas de doblar la pierna. El bote se queda... Se queda derecho. Pero mira estos. Mira estos. Mira, watch out. Watch out. Watch out. Let's see. Can you see this? I would put it on my table, but... Mira. Mira, esta bota sí son. Esos sí son de trabajo, mira. Este pinches bota sí son de trabajo. ¿Cómo vas a ir a un trabajo con botas nuevos, gorra nuevo, Ropa nuevo. Y dices, yo sé hacer todo. Mentiroso. <risa> yo ah, dado trabajo a gente que tiene todo nuevo. Y no, no saben hacer nada. Pero los que, los que este, tienen botas viejos. Así. Gorra. Viejo. Ropa. Viejo. Mira. Ropa. Viejo. Mira, mira, mira. Ok. Tengo Donald Duck peleando. El, el pato Donald. No sé cómo se dice en español. Nunca lo ha visto caricaturas en español. Pero. Mira este pinche pato. Mira. 
el pato dano a lo mejor se llama, no sé. Pero, mira, si alguien viene a trabajar así, yeah, 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 yeah. este cabrón sí sabe, este cabrón sí sabe porque está, está este sucio, listo para trabajar. El que viene con todo nuevo y que no tiene perro. <risa> Uh, me estoy jugando. Este, uh, no, pero sí, uno que viene a trabajar con todo nuevo y dice que yo sé hacer todo. Yo sé hacer todo. <ríe> ¿Cómo lo ven? ¿Cómo lo ven? Sí, tienes que, tienes que despertar, gente. Vengan, pero vengan para aprender. Si vienes con botas nuevos, dile. Yo soy nuevo, pero yo quiero aprender. Quiero aprender. Quiero aprender mucho. Ok. Nos vemos. Y los amo. Y síganme. Síganme. Porque yo te enseño a hacer cosas. Y cuando vas a un trabajo, pon un poquito mugre en el pinche gorro. Y en las botas. No vas con los nuevos. Mira. Bus si lo buscas unos nuevos, moja los cabrones botas. A ver si se van a durar. <ríe> Porque una vez yo compré unas botas nuevas. Los mojé los cabrones botas y se despegó la de adelante. Y yo estaba como, tenía como boca. El, el plato de la bota era Pla uh, derecho y la otra parte doblaba para arriba y como una pinche boca hasta que corrí atrás de mis hijos con los pinches botas esas ok gente nos vemos y que me sigan que dan gusto a esto y, y que sales para adelante échale ganas y no te quedes atrás Bada bing, bada boom. Adios, and that's what's up. Adios.